A lot of the women in my grilling clinics tell me that their biggest intimidation of grilling is starting a gas grill. So we're gonna go through A to Z, soup to nuts, how to start a gas grill. So if you watched my safety video, you know that you can actually test your grill to make sure you don't have any leaks with your propane down here at the propane tank and also in the hose. Before you start grilling, you do wanna make sure you have enough gas and most grills are gonna have a gauge that tells you how much gas you have. So that way you don't get stuck in the middle of a cookout with no gas, which is never a good thing. So after you know that you have enough gas, whoops, then you turn your propane tank on. And if you look at your grill, you're gonna see that on the knobs, there's usually something that looks like a little lightning bolt. And that's where you need to put the knob to put it into position. And when you do put your knobs there, you can usually hear the hiss of gas. And then you press the ignition button. And there you go. It's as simple as that. Now, oftentimes, if you have a grill that hasn't been well maintained or it's old, your igniter might be burned out, which means you're gonna have to use a lighter. And you can just simply take the lighter, lift up the grates, and start it that way. One thing to be aware of is that if you're trying to light your grill and it's not happening, um, turn your gas off because you don't wanna let the gas keep going with no light because you're just gonna collect more gas. And that's it, you guys. It's actually not that hard. What's great about gas is that it is simple. It's quick and easy. It's great for weeknight grilling. And you're gonna get a lot of great flavor. So I'll see you guys on the next video.